is Jen Lane. I'm from Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, as is my sister here. It was one I'm Meg <laughs> To wake up this morning, play like the real thing. I think it's good to, to play on each other's albums and do little things like that, but because keeping our career somewhat separate, I think, is a really is a really good way to go. Yeah. We both seem to be on an equal but page right now. Too, like, yeah, yeah, but we both seem to be getting equal amount of of uh, attention. attention at this point <laughs> in time. I have quite the business head on me, even though I don't particularly always like doing business. It's a part of the game. The music industry is a tough, it's a really very tough business. A lot of people won't take it seriously, especially if you're young. When you're trying to promote your own stuff and book your own tours and all that kind of stuff, it's just at a point it gets impossible and you need the people to speak for you. After the album's done, it's about looking for support from people who can push you to that next level. And it's very, really difficult to find in the independent music industry. There is a Saskatchewan style happening. And I think that's what's so cool about Saskatchewan right now is like all these artists that I used to be compared with are all doing completely separate things and all doing contemporary new things. I still absolutely have blues as my canvas and the painting is everything else on top of it. We're getting better with the original music scene, but we still have an awful lot of cover band material for how much talent we have here. So the venues are few and far between for music lovers to get to. I think that there needs to be a musical revolution, you know, how it was back in the 60s and 70s, where it's about music. I 